Hey, what's up guys? My name is Crescendo and welcome to Minotaur. It's a point-and-click sci-fi with a graphic novel feel, which is really cool. I'm very excited to get into it. I saw it on Game Jolt and uh, this is the demo, by the way. Looks like we've got one character to choose from, but there are other people. That looks... This one looks just like Aerith or Aerith from uh, Final Fantasy VII. Well, the silhouette does. But anyway, all right, so we've got Nod and that is the only character that we can select right now. But that's alright, let's go ahead and click Nod, and jump right in. Pikes. That's awesome. This game is fully voiced, so I won't be providing any of the voices this time. Which is kinda, kinda sad, but Mr. Pikes. I love listening to good voice actors. So hopefully this game has them. Mr. Pikes, I don't know if that's me or not. Nod. Yes it is. So Nod Pikes is my name. I'm cool with it. But look at this oh. art style, it's so beautiful. Dad. That hurts. Long night of clubbing. Do that to you. Of course it does. You slept for so long and you still reek of booze. Booze. Long night of clubbing. How can you tell, Ollie? I never installed any smell receptors. <laughs> okay, so she's like a cyborg or something. They're called olfactory receptors. And I don't need to smell. I can practically see it. Anyway, you have to pull yourself together and head out. Your night shift at the factory starts in half an hour. Night shift. Oh, crap! Why didn't you wake me up earlier? <laughs> now it's her By fault. By my calculations, thirty minutes is just enough. Just barely enough. <laughs> Snarky little android. You really need some tuning, Ollie. But you're right. I have to get going. My boss will never get off my ass. Bosses are just like that. All right, press escape for in-game menu. That's okay. All right, and now we get to sort of search around. And what do we want to look at first? Let's look at the workbench. I saw a screen cap of this, and I thought it just looked too good. I'm working on it, Ollie. You know it's expensive. An outfitter's license. How do you even hmm. manage to find clients for weapon enhancements without the permit? <laughs> I'm just that good, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and I guess all your clients have special reasons to work with someone who doesn't keep official records. Imagine so. Use the area at the bottom of the screen to return. Okay, I see. Alright, let's take a look at this. Looks like a type of pistol. Maybe some sci-fi plasma Soul shooting witness. thing. PHG-12 particle handgun manufactured by Slate Industries. Sounds cool as shit. It's almost completely silent, but lacks firepower. And I'm supposed to take care of that. So we make weapons. That's nice. Super nice. What is this about? No idea what that's about, or that, actually. Screwdriver! Screwdriver huh? Second most useful thing after a crowbar. <laughs> Very true. Oh, okay, cool. So, picked up a screwdriver. Can I pick up anything else on the table? Doesn't look like it, but let's Soul take a look at this. THG oh, we already did that. Almost I already saw that, thank you. No idea what those numbers represent. Wait a second. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, okay. It's almost like I'm being guided by some invisible hand. That's me. I'm the invisible hand. What's going on? Maybe I should oh, take there we go. A closer look at those triangular nodes on the left before leaving. Okay, I will do just that. What is that image? Aha! That's it. The invisible hand never lies. The invisible hand never lies. Never led me astray. Node Type A. Nodes are used to enhance weapon and armor properties. To use them, node bridge of the right... Wait, what? Node bridge of the right type must first be installed onto equipment, which is a job for an outfitter, which I happen to be... a... unlicensed outfitter. Okay. So, was that it now? Or do I put it into so here now? Nope. It's Same thing? Okay. And I guess now that's it. Got everything checked? Okay. Let's see. We don't want to exit yet. Let's look at the frame. See if that's some family. Irene, okay. Mr. Pikes, do you know what moving on means? So it's someone that he lost. You should try it sometime. That's sad. Nice picture though. It did move on. We're good friends now. Oh, well, she's not dead, so that's nice. But uh, they split up. Oh, that's gotta be rough. Yes. Your ex and her rich husband living right above you. Mm. Talk about healthy environment. Seriously, that is not you good for the throw psyche. Picture away and move someplace else while you're at it. You know, Irene did ask me to get rid of it recently. 
Someone told Arthur about it, and it made him furious. Remind me to do it... Tomorrow. Tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow. Okay, well, nice lovely pit... Wait, what? Ro rot oh, rotate. What's on the back? Beautiful. Wait, can I unscrew it? All right, then. Off you go. Oh, so I can just get rid of it right now. <laughs> Those were good days. Strange journey. That's the best, probably. Yikes. All right, can I pull it off? Can I get this bitch out of here? Can I chuck it? No? So that's basically it? Okay. My good old Let's see, D12 what's a D12? Storage, storage unit. It's empty. And they almost talked me into buying a D24. Let's look at the calendar here. I remember taking those photos of Irene in our local club. So Demon's that's our ex. That's Demon's armpit. That's fantastic. So that's our ex. She's now and super now famous. Performing on the stage of Supernova. Must be why she broke up with him. Wow. It's yesterday all over again. Happened yesterday. Irene, then and now. I'm a fan. <laughs> Yikes. The same thing? Okay. Uh, oh, I can click on these? Oh, wow, this will take forever. Wait, That's winter alignment. alignment days, when Hades and Logan, both our stars, rise up and go down at the same time. It's a very significant day. Cool name for stars. A day off. <laughs> I share that sentiment. Okay. Any more special days? Nothing. Wait. There's some That's summer alignment. alignment days. When Haiti, it's a oh, very same thing. Day. Okay, super. Thank you. All right, looks like that's it for the calendar. Uh, anything over here? Home brew. Ugh. I can't even look at that right now. <laughs> Too much drinking. All right, looks like all that's left is going to the balcony, exit, or the data feed, which we're gonna look at right now. Blurry and glitchy. Sure does. It's always been like that. You bought the cheapest data panel on the market. And a used one, too. Nothing wrong with buying used. No, that's not it. I think something's wrong with our access power grid. Maybe I should turn the panel off just in case. Just to be safe. I don't want to start a fire. How do I turn the panel off? Maybe out on the balcony. Not the best view in Nova. Ooh, very industrial. I can't hear Ollie from here. Who's Ollie? Oh, jeez. Jesus! <laughs> I have my Xbox controller plugged into my PC, and uh, the rumble feature was activated when the train passed. That was a little too lifelike. Jesus. Nobody knows why demons never attack trains. Demons? But don't let them get force in the mouth. Thanks to that phenomenon, trains are the only way to move safely between dome cities. Okay, well that's nice. Axis domes have shielded us from demons for almost oh, is that what that is? centuries. So that's like a shield. All that white stuff in the background. Those uh, images. I don't remember the name of the woman who invented them. But we all owe her our lives. Starting to feel like Final Fantasy XV. He who brings plague. Late, huh? Nasty. Yeah. I heard this demon recently became active in parts around Nova. Just look at him. I could never understand people who go outside domes willingly. You have no adventurer spirit, man. That's where all the fun is. Well, how the hell do I switch this thing off? Oh, I just click it again. Makes sense. All right, let's leave. Mr. Pikes. Or not. I don't like where this is going, but yes. yes. Do you want me to call the police? For what? What? Why? The hell did I do? Because you set the security alarm. That's why. Why would I do that while I'm home? Beats me. I see nothing here worth taking, including you. Didn't I build her? How rude. Well, you got drunk and started I'm your daddy. About how this Arthur guy from upstairs was after you, so... Ollie, I don't remember the code. Oh boy. Well, you did yesterday. Please let me out. No can do. Security protocol and all that. Come on, Ollie. You know I'm already late for work. Please. Let me think. No. Please disable the alarm first, Mr. Pikes, or I'll have to call the police. Good God. 
Can I just power her down? Oh wait, I need the code. Can I use the balcony? Who knows what they'll say about that little outfitting shop you run here? Sounds like blackmail. Not much of an assistant, are you? Right? Hey, I am. You can always ask me for advice. I can't tell you the code, but I can help you figure it out. Okay. Use Ollie icon to ask her for help if she's around. Oh, look at that cute little icon. That's adorable. So let me get this straight. You're using some date from your vacation with the woman who dumped you two years ago as a security. Okay, so that's why we can turn the picture around and open it up. Come on, Ollie. It's just a code. Just means nothing. Just a simple Still, couple of numbers. Four digits. Which month is Jess? I'm an advanced self-aware AI, Mr. Pikes. Consult your calendar for this. Okay, so we got to use a combination of this, 23, um, and the calendar. Wait, I don't want that. Go back. All right. Okay, so maybe that's not the year. That's just the day of the month of Jess, which Jess is uh, 06. So we'll try 0623. That ought to work. Wow, Mr. Ah, okay. It was easier really than I thought impressed. it was. Unlocked a music track. That's cool. I see that six years of Novian Institute of Science and Technology weren't wasted on you. Sure weren't. I'm a real smarty. You'll see how much I learned in AI tuning class. <laughs> Threats. All right, so now we can finally leave. All right, time to set a running world record. Cause I'm super late. I think you need to prepare yourself for a steeple chase, Mr. Pikes. Steeple, what? What the? The fuck is that? Are we blocked in with debris? What the Hades is this? It's like a bunch of cheese. I don't know. The day before, so we're jumping on, back Ollie. now. You know it's me. Just let me in. So, uh, security cam footage. What about all those repurposing threats? What you talking about? Just kidding. Having trouble, baby. Who are you, miss? Whoa. <laughs> oh, Irene. Irene, obviously. Great. <clears throat> gotta deal with this snarky <throat> shit. <baby. laughs> Please stop calling me, baby. <laughs> Come on, naughty. Water under the bridge. More like a swamp. Shut up, Ollie. I've got fine, something Irene. to say. I just forgot my key at the factory. Would you like me to ask Arthur to get help from that creepy concierge of his? Fuck no, fuck Arthur. No, I don't want you to ask Arthur. I'll figure something out. Why even suggest such a thing? See? Thanks, Rude. Nod, wait. I need to talk to you about something. Talk to hand? I don't want to hear it. Would you- Whoa, whoa, look at the face in the back. It's the face from the, uh, from the main menu screen. Would you like to come in? I didn't notice that before. Has that been there this whole time? Not really. Or is that just getting more and more opaque? No? You don't want to come in? Well, fuck you, I have some damn fine Norwegian wine from one of my clients. We could talk about old times. Yeah, that's a great like idea. when you first got your synthetic cords and they tuned them wrong. Yeah, the disaster at Demon's Armpit. Such a lovely place. You got so upset and drunk that I had to carry you home. Nod. Yeah, sorry. It's not reminisce about the past. What do you want to talk about? Did Arthur buy the whole building now and wants to evict me? It's related to him, yes. That's what every ex-boyfriend who still loves his ex-girlfriend wants to hear. His shit about the new, uh, significant other. You know how he's uncomfortable with us being friends? <laughs> totally not my problem. I Might understand. Be. It's difficult for me, too. He can be jealous sometimes. That's an understatement. I know. We fight about it often. In fact, the last time was only a couple of days ago. It wasn't about you specifically. Sounds like a real a-hole. So nice to hear that. Should totally dump his but ass. It came up that you still have that photo. This again. From our vacation in Mira. Man, why are you, why are you digging up shit that don't concern you anymore? And he got fixated on that. It happens sometimes. Things like that happen. Wait, you can't be serious. I am. Please, Nod. This is ridiculous. Nod, just get rid of that photo. Trust me, it's better this way. Mm -hmm. Much better. Irene? Is that... is that him? Looks like a real stick-up-his-ass prick. Oh, still. 
Irene, there you are. So. I knew I'd find you here. Nod. Creep. Arthur. Ollie. <laughs> Have really? a pleasant conversation? Am I interrupting? Yeah, you are, asshole. Why talk here in the corridor? Go on. Have a drink at his place. You're a real piece of work, Arthur. He probably invited you. No. How dare you, sir? So what if I did, you controlling freak? Punch him in the face with that mechanical arm. Show him what for. Oh, stop it, Nod. You too, Arthur. Nod just forgot his key and needed help, but it's it's fine now. Totally fine. We're leaving. Super fine. Come on, let's go. You don't have to ask me twice. I came here for you, not the other way around. Nod, do what I asked you to. Please. No. Bye, Irene. Can't make me. <sighs> Poor Nod. I hate that guy. I do too. Okay. I'm glitching out there. That's cool. U7 Committee presents... I think that's how you say that. Oh, that looks cool. I really like the art. So pretty. Nice. Mechano Man. What the fuck? Is that an emperor penguin with like a shotgun? That's intriguing to say the least. Very good intro. Minotaur. I can dig it. Alright, so that was the first chapter. Really cool. Oh, I hate he's and Logan. Alright, we're back to this nonsense. Wonder if Arthur had something to do with it in some crazy way. But I'm gonna leave you guys hanging and myself, because that's all the time we have. For this episode, I'm going to continue and play through the demo. Uh, I like it a lot that they have it uh, categorized into chapters, which makes it a lot easier on my end to know when it's going to end. Um, but yeah, I'll leave a link in the description so you can play this too. Remember, it is a demo. Uh, consider it early access, so possible bugs and glitches and stuff like that. But so far, it's a really intriguing game. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.